The Women Who Manifest conference is just around the corner. And if you're a woman looking to transition or transform, not concerned, not concerned, Sing Tai Song and Crystal Nelson are here with us to talk about tapping into the divine feminine power within, as well as our very own Karina, who will join the panel of powerful women. I just feel so honored to sit with all of you ladies. <laughs> Thank you. So, so such an honor. Such an honor. And um, tell us more about the event. Would you like to, um, cause, well, Women who manifest because, I mean, it's 2023, right? And we're all about manifestation this year. Mm -hmm. We have to tap into our divine power. Uh, we have so many powers within us and we hold ourselves um, back a lot of the times based on fear. Mm -hmm. And um, with this conference, we want women to come in and have a vulnerable, safe place, mm. to shed their egos, to leave their titles at home, and really just be and relax in a safe place. So it's gonna be uh, a transformative and healing experience for our, our audience that comes. Mm. Good too. Love that. Yeah. And uh, tell us a little bit about your background. Well, me, I am a serial entrepreneur. Mm -hmm. um, I am the FinTech founder of a company called Plenty. We do bookkeeping, accounting, and tax preparation services, as well as estate planning. Um, I, I'm also the co-founder of a company called University for Kids yes. in KU Kids Deanwood. Uh, we have four locations in County. Um, it's actually a legacy uh, that I'm continuing on for my parents. My parents, John and Cassandra Nelson, have been in the childcare field for many, many years. So my sister and I decided to go into to business together, and we have uh, a chain of childcare centers and growing in Washington, D.C. I love that term, serial entrepreneur. I know, <laughs> I know, I need that in my family. <laughs> I need that in my family. And uh, Knock Horse 3, I'm sorry if I pronounced your name yeah. incorrectly, but um, you are inspirational author and speaker, so tell us about your book. Um, the book is called Queen, Take Off Your Mask and Wear Your Crown. Mm, that's a good uh, snap just for the title. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yeah, I'm all about shedding the ego, sh um, shedding the fear-based mentality and stepping into your true divine self. Mm -hmm. um, I definitely went through a huge spiritual transformation um, during the pandemic and I had to clear my blockages, I had to reprogram my mind, um, I had to heal a lot from yeah. my traumas and everything like that. So I discovered that, you know, I was yearning for a community that was just like me. Mm -hmm. You know, I was yearning for a community that were doing the inner work, um, that was able to truly be themselves, but also as you're healing, you're still manifesting. You know, you want to tap into both worlds, you know, your inner world and your external world. And so um, I was really excited that, you know, um, God gave me a vision to do a platform where, you know, it's building that bridge. Yeah, mm. so powerful. I love that. And uh, quick question, with your financial background, will you be bringing any of that to the com conference? Just for our audience, I, I feel like financial literacy for women it is such so an important, important topic. Yeah. It's so important because as women, we go through a lot of different things. We go through tra transition from uh, divorce or mm -hmm. uh, we're single moms and uh, we carry a lot of these things with us and we want to build generational wealth for our children. And women are stepping up to the plate these days and I will be talking about a lot of different tactical tools that you can actually implement into your lives um, and help you to become financially secure, whatever that looks like. You know, we all want freedom and that's the main thing, but yes, I mm -hmm. will be talking about a lot of different strategies, investment strategies, tax strategies, um, and just overall, just being financially secure. I love that. I'm tax strategies. Yes, <laughs> oh God. <laughs> I have to hire somebody for that. I a wizard. I know, <laughs> my goodness. I'm turning the tables really quickly. Why was it so important for you to be a part of this? We we are so inspired by your story yeah. and your poetry. Mm. Yeah. So tell us about your part. Well, I'll be uh, doing a performance poetry uh, for the event yeah. just to uh, bring my gift to the table and activate uh, the emotional component for yes. people yeah. so that you know they tap in immediately your hearts are open mm -hmm. and then you can receive the message that yeah. uh, that you're there to receive and this is why I so many people that. love you yeah. we, we love you so much <laughs> yes. so I love everyone I know <laughs> we feel it we love everybody we feel the love. love and so I hear there's an app so tell us more about that. So I'm creating an app where I can connect the top experts to the audience. So it's literally, you know, coaches, consultants, um, finance experts, wellness experts, all of that stuff. So um, it's going to be a community for women who manifest, and um, it's in the it's in the process. But I believe that by the 24th, I'm manifesting that it will be complete. <laughs> 
manifestation <laughs> of work. Manifest. Yes. 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 <laughs> and where can people sign up for the conference? Okay, so we have an Eventbrite. Um, you gotta search Women Who Manifest Ascension Conference, um, or just go into mine or Crystal's um, Instagram, and it's in our bio. Beautiful. And, and what are your Instagrams for our audience? Um, at Unicorn That's so cute. <laughs> mine is at Crystal Nelson, and that's spelled K-R-I-S-T-Y-L, Nelson, N-E-L-S-O-N. Wonderful, thank you. Well, I'm manifesting that I'm gonna keep in contact with all of you and all of this is gonna rub off, so I'm yes. manifesting Can that. Can I mention one thing that please, I manifested please. this year? Uh, my partner and I, we just purchased a 30-acre resort. Mm -hmm. in Congratulations! Yes. Oh my God! Yes. Wow! Yes. Something that uh, is really big in my life right yes. now. So we're, we're developing a 30-acre resort, it's called The High Life. Yes. Um, I have uh, several partners and it's gonna be amazing and I will uh, share that. Uh, at the conference as well. Yes. Wow. Tap energy. Tap a resort. <laughs> I know. I know. Big energy. Yes. Yes. Look, so we're going to do retreats at her, you know, yes. resort Very and nice. everything. It's amazing. Amazing. Congratulations. I love it. It's amazing. It's amazing. I love so that. Everybody's going to get their tickets now. I know. Yes. Get your tickets. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much, ladies. Thank, Thank you.